Hey, 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 what's up? This is your boy Mike the Dome once again with my homie Billy Boy. Billy Boy, what's happening, Mike? Yo. The Heights Podcast. Yo, we haven't done an a, a, a episode in a while. In a while. Man. We've, been, we've been lacking, man. No, no, we've no. You lacking. know what it is? You know, we had to take that, that studio we had for the mm-hmm. Heights. Yeah. We had to take it apart. Mm-hmm. You know, this is the furniture for yeah, the heights. Right, right. You know, brought it here, but we're doing a little something. Something so we can up. get back in track, interviewing. You yeah. know, something, something, the personalities from back in the, the days. Back in the days. Back in the days. But, There's a lot of them out here to tell you the truth. Yeah, man. But we need. We, we're, uh, we're gonna pursue. Them. Either bring them or go to them. Go, go to them. Either way. Either way, but we either need to or. interview. You know, because people like hearing histories, especially. You know, about the highs. You no, know, and, and that history specifically, those years, Mike, that we were there, man, yo, that's, 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 that, that shit has history, man. Yo, talking about that, remember the other day we was talking about when we was chamaquitos, mm-hmm. who were the OGs mm-hmm. that, that we saw as mm-hmm. like, oh, shit, look mm-hmm. at that nigga. Mm-hmm. And you mentioned Marino, Marino, that you were related to it's him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did. Yo, but this dude. Well, he was. Yo, you, you remember Capacete and them dudes? It was, those were that, the, that, those were gangsters. Yeah, those were, yeah, yeah. Those were gangsters. But Marino was was. was remember, Marino went to the army. He was. A, yeah, that's what he, I heard. That's why his he, name. He was a military. Ma, ma, yeah. Marino is militar. Yo, so that, they, that nigga that, had that history. Dude, man. That dude. No, he made history. He is history. Damn. And his family. You know where family. I seen him at? I don't know if you remember. The Villara, 172nd in Amsterdam. Uh, of course. The Luperon. Of course. Ahí yo lo conocí. And I was a 15-year-old kid, bro. He used to call me, you know what was his nickname? What? The Devil. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to speak about that one. Oh, man. shit. Yo. Yo, We talking devil. about niggas that were. No, no, no. Gangsters no, no, in no, the no, 70s, no. Those bro. dudes were out of, out of order. Let me tell you when. Something that happened one time. Well, every time you used to see me because we were related. Okay. And I was a young little kid. So, you know, five dollars to me at that time. She. Shit. I was like, I was like yo, I was like, yo, what, buddy? You know, I was like, yo, buddy, no. A every slice of I pizza see, was 35 cents. So bro, imagine I used five to go to the, to the games. Okay. They had uh, mm, these games that were uh, 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 pinball. Pinball. And, yeah, pinball machine. Yeah, that, that's what they had back in the day. Man. So I, it's a candy store. Yes, yeah, so like yeah. can, those candies, a pack of candy. Because I, with thirty cents, they had the whole candy box with with machine all day. And then you know, one day uh, he approached. I was with my mother. But how, how are you related? Well, he's my cousin, and primo hermano. He's my cousin. Get the fuck so out we're of family, here. his sisters, and his brother, who got m- murdered by the police department over there. Yeah, it was. It was. It was. It was, it was yeah, his sister. Damn. <clears throat> Excuse me. His sister went to she go to my house and constantly when I was a kid. And uh, one time I'm walking up 161 towards Riverside. From Broadway to Riverside. You got Broadway for Washington uh-huh. and then Riverside. Yeah. We lived in Riverside. We still okay, live there. Okay. My sister. I and remember my Riverside. They had, they they had, had that, that, little, that, that little street. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that that you could jump over and there was like exactly. uh, that, a green I, area. I live in that building in the corner. That's like Riverside Drive. Riverside Drive. Correct. Okay, Riverside yeah. Drive. That's because uh, Riverside was more down. M- more down. Okay. More down. It was like a little... little. It little, was like from 158... 158 to, to 165. 165th. With, with, a, with a parking lot for the hospital started. That was a, yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. Exactly. So I'm walking That's down... That's a nice area, man. That's beautiful. Now it's Big even, ass Now it's, it's even better. And so I'm walking down with my mother and, you know, going to my house as a kid. And Your mom's still alive? No, she passed away. Who lives in that apartment? My sister. Yeah, 50, years. 50 years. Pagando chelo. 50 years. 50 years. Gentrification bro. didn't get to her. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's her. <laughs> Take that. That's yours. <laughs> A landlord, man. Give her. Give her that shit. Yes, I love my mother. De... No, no. De, esa no es la no, mamá de. No, de ¿Cómo le- que se llama? El de- Trinitario? Lex. Lex. No. Esa I, I see him on. Uh, uh, on Instagram. Yes, I've been the we got to bring him again we'll, when we hook we'll, up the studio. We're we'll bring him again. He yeah. got he got more stuff. Okay. And uh, I got I got more stuff too. We need to. We, that's a lot of shit that's to be said, shit. bro. We, 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 we're gonna talk a lot of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready. So, so Marino, so I'm walking up and Marino calls me. 
so I know he's gonna hit me off. Okay. So my, my, my mother has me. I let that. <laughs> Marino. So he comes and he gives me five dollars. Okay. You sabe? See. I'm like Marino, tío, primo. It was everything. You, you, you didn't even smoke. Back no, then. none. <laughs> Dude, I was like, so my mom, he 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 goes, Luis, Luis, she's my mother's back. Because my mom didn't, you know, yeah, she yeah. knew. She knew what, this what, dude. What was he? He he was dealing or no, stick up? No, or what he the fuck was, did he, he do? Was, he was a, a hitman. Uh, he was a hitman. Oh, shit. And he was robbing dudes and taking their shit. And take, like, that's what I heard. Like, that like, he like, would take yo, your shit. He would come to you, yo, I need two two jammies at 2 o'clock. If you didn't have it, it's over. Game over. This Man, dude was out of I heard church. shit. Yeah, I heard shit Bro, about him. Let me, I have a couple of stories. So, my mother tells me, one, remember those... Those pools, ear, sí, ear sí. pools. Jalón de oreja. Jalón de oreja y vaina. Yeah. Retorcía y no, para arriba. No, pa, yo, yo estaba en el aire. <laughs> I was in the air. <laughs> I was like, yo, ¿qué? What happened? Don't ever take money from that man again. I've been taking money all the time. <laughs> <laughs> This is not the first time. And the diablo. Hey. Yeah, you know, I say, well, yeah, you, I already have the five dollars in yeah, my pocket. Yeah. I just didn't yeah. go nowhere. It wasn't coming out. No, I didn't go nowhere. <laughs> I, I received my peco song. Okay. I received my little chat, but I had the five dollars. <laughs> so when I go home, mom, I'll be right back. Yeah. Candy store. So every time I used to see him, he used to hit me off, and, and it was it was great. Uh, and this dude was was the dude was evil, son. I mean, the word evil, he was evil. He had no mercy. You know, I don't want to get too deep into this dude, but I could write a book about him. I'm serious, man. This dude was off the charts. Um, one time, I'm taking a haircut. There was a barber shop in 160, between 164th and 163rd Street on the right-hand side. In Broadway. In Broadway. Broadway. You know, that's what my, my uncle's... <laughs> <clears throat> my uncle had a... A sastreria, a tailor shop. I used to, I, and then he moved it to 157. I went there a lot, 157. Okay, but before it was, it was in there? Broadway, yeah. It was there. When I got to New York in 1974, it the was sastreria was in like 163rd, between 162nd, one. Oh, yeah. it, Yo, it no, was I, in I know, I know who it, I know, because I was there, I got there, I was there in 72. Yeah. I was there in 72. So his, Porfirio. in 74, it was on Broadway mm -hmm. between one six. It was in one of those, one no, of those blocks. between 161 and 162. That's I where think. it was at. It was, I think it was in the, it was in the, it was in the basement. No, 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 it was, it was a local, it right. was a Because storefront. I, I had another one that used to go down the step. Remember, it no, was a storefront, one, then he moved to 157. That one? When, when, when you take 157 to go towards Riverside. Right. And then you either go up Riverside Drive or, or down Riverside Avenue. Exactly, exactly. I had one in 186th Street. But then, I'm, I'm the way I take a haircut there with this dude. I'm already in my teens. Okay. Because this dude was for a while. Mm -hmm. Marina was there for a while. And I'm taking a haircut. And I'm waiting for the dude. He's cutting the, he's a captain from the NYPD, 30th, 34th. Precinct. Okay, okay. Because he wasn't 30th yet. The 30th wasn't there. It was the, no, the 33rd wasn't there. The 33rd was started 30th, in 165th. No, 30th, the 30th, 155th. The 30th precinct started in 155th. And the in 34th, the, the, the precinct was in 152nd and It's Amsterdam. Amsterdam. Behind but, the park in had, Amsterdam. They had the patrol from 155th to 137. Oh. That was that area. Okay. And okay. the 34 was like from 19, from Dykeman, with okay. Dykeman, towards 155th. Okay, okay. And that's why now it's they have, area. now it's a big area. Now they have 33rd precinct. In between. Which in between. Because it was... 33rd started 33rd. In, in 160... 168, 169. 165th, right I think, where, where, where one, the St. No, Rose is. It started in 165 in front of St. Rose. But now it's in 170. Now it's in 170 and something's... Uh, Edgecombe. Edgecombe, Edgecombe and after that. Yeah, because Alofi, Alofi sent me a video. Right, that, exactly. Now it's there. So the captain, they was talking about Marino, and the captain said in, in his bad Spanish... Marino, mucho malo, huh? mucho malo. And you was there. And I was there. And, and I was like, this dude, you know, a captain speaking about this dude. You know, they knew him. 
Mm-hmm. I don't know if you remember Batman and Robin because you was further uptown. There were two cops called uh, Batman and Robin in our area. They used to be from the 30th Precinct now. They were coming, that 30th Precinct came. One from. was blonde and the other one had black hair? <coughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, I remember yeah. them. Yeah, there was Sanchez and Vélez. Oh, no, 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 no. no. Sanchez and Vélez. I remember Sanchez. Sanchez, you was a... That, so, that do, he, he turned out to be corrupt. He they got him, he got, got locked up 15 years, I think, something like oh. that. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that nigga hit me with a, with a, with he, a... With, with, a, a, with the stick. With the stick on my knee. He hit me here with a stick. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, he, he, he was a Puerto Rican brother. Yeah, know? yeah, yeah. And the other one was Vélez. He was also Puerto Rican. Okay, now I'm but, thinking about two other cops. Yeah. They were gringos. And then, you know, these dudes. One day I was in 163rd between, well, Broadway. Because it was Broadway and St. Nick. The hot spot in 163rd was Broadway and St. Nick. Yeah, that was like Vietnam. 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 That was yeah, the Vietnam. Name. So I was 163rd in Broadway, going to store Saint Nick, and I see Marino. Uh, you know, Marino, primo, eh? How are you? Eh? Bien. And he's talking with this dude, and and I stay there, and the dude tells him, "Yo, you you know something?" And he goes, "What? Sanchez is looking for you." He says, "Sanchez is looking for me." <laughs> Sanchez is looking for me. Yeah, yeah, he came right here. Where's, where's Marino? And he said, oh, okay, I'll who, tell you who, what. Who Marino was? Okay. Scientists were looking for Marino. Okay. I don't know what for. Okay. But the dude's telling him that scientists had come around and, and was looking for Marino, asking okay. for Marino. Where's Marino? Where's Marino? Marino, a tough guy. See. And Marino said, all right, tell him I'm looking for him now. Yo, when you see him, tell him I'm looking for him. Now I'm there listening to this conversation. Oh, I'm there. Sick. But check it out. Guess who's coming in the police car? Sanchez. Sanchez, <laughs> <laughs> Sanchez and Vélez are coming from 163rd, because 163rd comes up towards Broadway. Yeah, yeah, it was a one-way. From St. Nicholas. Yeah, it was a one-way. And the, and, and the dude says, oh, there's a cop. And everybody says, cops, cops. You know, see, everybody, everybody. La Jara. La Jara, La Jara. See, Agua. See. So everybody's like, oh, stashing, you know, yeah, we're doing yeah. this shit. And it was Sanchez and Vélez. Uh, and when he heard, it, this dude, Marino used to carry an army jacket. He was in the army. Yeah. With a vest. With uh, all his. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he heard Sanchez and Vélez. So he, yo, Mike, this dude's, a, this dude's a fucking nut. He stops in the middle of the block. The street. Marino. Marino the street. Oh. This I saw. This, okay. this, this wasn't the This is not a me. urban history. No, no. no. Urban this, legend. This I saw with my okay. eyes. He stopped in the middle and he opened, unzipped his jacket and opened it. <laughs> and, and when Sanchez and Vélez see him, yeah. they slow down, but up to zero, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker did he want? Slow motion. Yo, these dudes, I was like, they're never gonna come. <laughs> and I'm in the corner watching. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I mean, Chamaquito. No, because he told me. He told me, move, mete para allá. Sí, sí. So, they stopped. It was like, it was like a face-off. Oh, It was like shit. a face I'm telling you, I could write a book about this dude, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, Marino's in the street. The car's coming. So, it's a face-off. But they're watching him with all his, all his material. Yeah. He has everything. He's ready. He's always ready. Dude's a, 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 a Marine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. The dude's a monster. Yeah. So, he tells him, Sanchez, they don't come I out. Think, I think he was a military from here. There's the Aki from the yard. El Tipo, El Tipo, he was a, he was a sharpshooter over there. Ah, oh, shit. He was a sharpshooter. Oh, he wasn't a sharpshooter. A sniper. So, a sniper, sniper. Oh, so, so shit. Sanchez doesn't come out. And I'm saying, oh, I'm looking, but I'm yeah. saying this dude's not coming out. So he th- his, Sanchez sticks out his head. You know, the police window. Marino, cabrón, ¿qué pasa? He said, no, 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 cabrón, ¿qué? You looking for me? In Spanish. Okay. Because Marino didn't know English. Okay, okay. Well, he knew English, pero no así. He broke it down. But he knew, he, he, he is his Spanish. He, yeah. he understood English. He, put, he went to the army, Marines. Yeah. But he didn't hardly speak it. So he said, ¿tú me looking for me, cabrón? Me? I'm looking for you? Who said that? <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, oh, I was shit. like, 
oh shit, I'm, like, I'm, yeah. I'm stunned because yeah. the cops. Yeah. Velez and Sanchez, bro. Yeah. Everybody's terrified of this I dudes. remember Sanchez. These dudes are stick up kids, robbers. I mean, yeah. this dudes where you should go to spots and, and, and give me everything and I'm gone. T TV. <laughs> Sanchez was carrying TV radios. <laughs> On his squad car. God, but, uh, with his uniform. <laughs> damn. Police uniform. And they, and so, I'm, so, so I'm standing looking at this battle. There's, there's, yeah. a, there's a standoff. Yeah. Everybody's panic. Yeah. The whole block is in silence. Bro, you could hear a pin drop. You know, those blocks are very noisy. Oh, way, waha, sube. And that block was like, that shit went dead. And I'm in the, and I'm in the corner and I'm in the building. I'm like, shit. What's going on? So he's like, "Yo, are you looking what, for me?" What year was this? This was, I was already, I was already, I was already in my. It was, shush. I was entering high school. It was eighty something. It was in the eighty something. Okay. It was early eighties. Okay. Our eighty something. It wasn't the past nineties. Okay. It wasn't past nineties. And I'm and I'm and I'm there looking at the show because I want to see what the, the outcome mm -hmm, <laughs> of mm -hmm. the show. So my so Sanchez is. Screaming and hollering, who the fuck told you that? Who told you I was a cabron? Who told you I was looking for you? I never, I've never looked for you in my life. <laughs> oh, oh shit. He's a, whoever told you that's a fuck. Who told you that? But he didn't come out of the car. He didn't come out of the car. Yeah, Velas was just there. And he's like, yo, if you have a, no, let's settle it now. The pro, if you're looking, I'm looking for you now. <laughs> What's going on? So there's a standoff. My, uh, Sanchez is, was head over. Velas is quiet. Marino's screaming. Sanchez is screaming. Who said it? Who did it? I didn't say it. I wasn't looking. I've never been looking for you. And I'm like, it's, I, I'm here look, watching this shit. And I'm like, that's my cousin. El orgullo. Yo, 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 <laughs> yeah, he said no one time because I'm gonna tell you another story. So this stops, the, you know. Uh, Sanchez is begging. No, I didn't do nothing. No, no, but sigue por ahí, cabrón. Continue your way. I don't got. I don't have a problem with you. <laughs> Me and you don't have a problem. A cop. Yeah. I'm telling a fucking gangster. Yeah. <laughs> he's not wrong. I say, es mi primo. <laughs> Yo está aquí ahora. Oh, so, man, Sanchez, you know, Sanchez de Gracia. De Gracia, wow. Yo, this dude? Let, let, before you continue with Marino, and I forget, Sanchez, <coughs> you know that back in the days when you was, I was in junior high school, 143. I know you was in state. In state, right. In 1977, we chipped in to buy a loose joint, bro. Imagínate tú. And I take out, I take out the junk. And I, That's you know, paper probably. <laughs> big bamboo, two, two, paper. two, two papers. Paper, yeah, two papers, yeah. Para que fuera de que durara más quemando. And I pass it to homie, pa, light it up. We sitting on, on 182nd between Amsterdam and Audubon. This nigga, saw us from from Audubon and asked un carro sí. to take him around 181st to come through 182nd in Amsterdam towards, you know, 182nd was a one way from right. Amsterdam towards, right. and they had 34 precincts. Right. This is 1977. And this nigga got off the car. He used to walk around con un palo de, de hacha. You know the, sí. the, the axe? Sí, sí. He el used palo, el palo. Sanchez, Sanchez. Yeah. This nigga came out the car with this shit. Try to run. Try, <laughs> try to run. He arrested me. I'm 12 year old. Yeah. He arrested me, took me to 34 precinct, and said that I was a dealer, that I was dealing Dude, in junior was, high that, school. He was a bastard. That and was a this nigga used to, and this I was like, was a motherfucker, God bro. damn. Yeah. Me la puso difícil. Yeah. After that, I remember this white chick came to junior high school 143 from St. Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. You know, in junior high school 143, all we had was Cubans, Puerto yeah. Ricans, yeah. Dominicans, and blacks. blacks. There was no white people there. And this white girl came, and they sat her in one of my class in front of me. Mm -hmm. 
So I'm behind her, teasing her. A bully. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Wait till I get you when we come <laughs> out of school. She's new, so she got scared. Yeah. She went to the principal's office. Right. And they came to get me from the principal's to office. question you. <laughs> and bring me, you so know, because she dean, was a... They had dean there? Yeah, the dean's dean. office? I don't yeah. know. I, I remember the that dean's I went... Dean's office, yeah. And I went because she was crying that I had um, threatened her, that I was going to hurt her, mm -hmm. and whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. Guess who they called? Vela Sanchez. Sanchez. Because <laughs> he was in the 34 precinct. Yeah, he was in, then in, he the, went to the, in the 30th. The yeah, yeah, in the 30th, that's when I heard that he yeah. became corrupt. I, I, he forgot to say, right. Said right. That, so this nigga came in the, in, the, in the office, and he goes, you again. Now, I already knew you and shit. Yeah. yeah. And I was like, I was just playing. I'm a little kid. Yeah. I was just playing with her. We were talking about 12, 13. Yeah. I was just playing with her because she was the new girl in class. Well, you you tease, know, right? bullying. That word didn't yeah, exist back then. Right. So I was just playing. And he goes, well. Hey, pop. Pop. <laughs> Go take that. <laughs> Let's play then. Pop. Pop. I, yeah. Yeah. He said, you, you're not going to feel it now. Yo, I was, I was limping. <laughs> I think I'm still limping. No, for real. That for nigga real. hit me in my knee. Nigga, <laughs> nigga, well, now he's like, God damn, this <laughs> fucking dude. Man. So, but it was so those days. Keep telling me about my And I was, you know, one time I was in 100, because, you know, it's from, from 163rd and 161 to 160 was the action. Say, say, no. That was say, the area of Vietnam, say, really. Say. So I'm on 160, you know. And I'm arguing with this dude, you know. I'm there. I was I was trying to make a name. Tu sabes? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Trying to make a name, and I'm and I'm and, and I'm and I'm walking up on 60, and you know, one of the customers came, and I, you know, Marino's, I'm Marino's cousin, <laughs> you know. So the dude comes, yo, you know, he's telling me I'm I'm, I'm young. This dude's an old mm -hmm, man, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but I I confront him because I used to, you know, I used to box and shit, and, and I and I confronted him. And I was like, yo, and then guess who's passing? Marino's walking around with a police car, police siren, police badge. Yeah, he had everything. Oh, shit. He, with, with four dudes in the back. One, no, three dudes. One, two, three. Four people in the car. A police car. You thought it was a police car. Sirens and everything. But literally, bro, this dude was but walking like around. Like an undercover? Like an undercover. Okay. Placa okay. and everything. Yeah, yeah. When he used to go to the apartment and knock, he used to show you the placa. He told us a when he went in, he do sorry. <laughs> Take everything. So you know what this is. So, so when I when I when I'm, I'm walking with this dude, and Marino sees me, and he stops. Primo, when the dude heard that I said primo, capio. No, vino Marino sapea. ¿Qué pasó primo? He go no este tipo, porque este tipo vino porque porque yo yo no tengo miedo. I'm not scared. Yeah, I don't give a fuck now. Like, I'll get my big yeah, brother. Yo. And I'm like, yo, no. And I said, I got, you know. So Marino tells him, stop. So he says, yo, listen. And then he, he, he voiced. He said, listen, everybody. No, attention. Yes, sir. <laughs> listen, everybody listen in the block. Billy Boy is my cousin. Whoever touches Billy Boy here is going to have to see me. It was a wrap. Was, I took it over. I took over. <laughs> <laughs> I took over. Everybody oh, was like, yo, Billy. Shit. Yo. <laughs> yo, but the dude was, no. He they, they he got murdered by NYPD. Yeah, I heard that. In 165th Street in Nottenbund. It was like a setup. They were waiting for him. Yeah. I have, I have the story. I have that story. Okay. Clearly. And his sister, after he, he passed away, went to my house. Okay. To my mother. And she said, I'm going to file a lawsuit against the NYPD. My mother said, you're crazy. What are you going to do? This dude has... See, <laughs> see, see. You know, I hate what Damn, that nigga was... With a, the dude. That, the dude. If, if we talk about triple OGs... No, the dude, the dude. Yeah. That, that nigga. But he had a brother. He had a couple of... But he had three, two... two uh, there were two other of them. Uh, the one guy also kept the same routine. Okay. But the police department also... Took care of yeah, him. took care of him too. And the other one, Santaguito is, you know, he's still alive. And, and But 
Está quitado. Está quitado, pero, but, but those days were, were like, you know, it was horrible because the, the, the murder rate in Washington Heights zoomed because of him. Damn. Zoomed, they zoomed. Three, four a day, bro. What year he got killed? It's nine, it was already, yes, the years is now, I don't have a good memory about that. But <laughs> it came I remember the, him from the 80s. Out, uh, in the 80s. He was, it was still alive. It wasn't past the 90s because okay. he didn't pass the, the 90s. Because the dudes, los tigres que sonaban en esos tiempos era Marino, Capacete, Capacete eh, this nigga, eh, eh, el dueño del Baturro. Eh, de los Santos. De los Santos. Se llamaba. Eh, ah, me metieron en verdad. Apellido de los Santos. Uh, uh, you know, Apellido de los Santos. Yeah. The, 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 the niggas de. Uh -huh. ¿Tú me entiendes? Había uno que tenía como un, un dice room ahí, between 173 and 174, que también tenía como un. un, como un Marino used to go there a lot. Yeah, ahí jugaban dice. He used to, he used to go there next to the funeral. He used to go there all the time. And that nigga, el dueño de eso. Had like a like a after hour mm. on 184 and, and out of and, uh, and Amsterdam, Amsterdam in Amsterdam. the corner. Eh, eh. I forgot that nigga's ah, name. Yeah, he was he had I, one. I remember he hit, he hit this dude from 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 173rd in the bathroom I, of that place. I remember Luke used to work with him. Luke. Le, le, le dio ahí, pa, pa, that nigga went running to 34 precincts and Grando and shit. Lo quitó de la eh, calle. Desde eh, eh, ahí, that nigga became pussy. Ese club se llamaba... Era una barra. Sí, una barra. Sí, que había, sí. Me, sí. Me, me Pero I forgot that nigga's name. Pero esos eran los tigres. Esos tigres eh, que, bueno, que nosotros, Luperón. Sí. Luperón and his brother Henry. Sí, sí, Que sí. tenían el billar ahí en 172nd. And... Those are... Those, those are... are those, those are the triple OG. Those are... You know, I, I... We grew up in those days and I'm like... Sometimes I think about them, those dudes and I'm like, shit. But I used to see them in Beamers and, you know, in Mercedes in those days. Bro. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. I was like, shit, you know. Uh, uh, 163, 161, 160 was like the capital of... of, of yeah, because at that time, at that's that time, if you want the song blow it was, it or whatever, there. It, was there. it was there. It was there. Damn, Bailey, we need to get together because that's a lot of history. Yeah, we're going to talk heist. some more, right. But we, gotta, we need to talk about the good stuff too. Right, of course. You know what we should get together and talk about? The parties they did in the Audubon Ballroom. Oh yeah! Before they also before did hip hop became hip hop. They also remember did, we went there. Yeah, to top rock and right. dance and they, break dance and all that. They also did parties in the lighthouse, bro. Remember the lighthouse? Uh, uh, under, the under Riverside, the Riverside Jams. Underneath Riverside, Riverside Jams. Underneath the George Washington Bridge. Oh, we need Washington to talk about Bridge. all that shit, Underneath man. the George Washington Bridge. Like, tremendo, bro. Okay, right. yo, right. let's cool. leave it at that. Right. So we didn't change the subject. But we was talking about this um, urban legend. I know probably some of young young cats won't no. know about this no. nigga. But I know some of the old cats like us heard of Marino, heard of Capacete, heard of um, this dude from, from El Baturro, yeah. De Los the Santos, Santos, whatever. And Luperon and his brother. And there was other dudes, but I just yes, can't yes. remember it's their lot, names. Lot of dudes, yeah. Those are niggas that, you know, you saw them, you were like, I grew, My respect. We grew up to you. Yeah, yeah. When, when those are the real heart, 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 heart names. Those are those are like the first uh, generation. Yeah. To be honest with you. Yeah, yeah. Because they didn't even speak English. No, they didn't even speak they, English. There wasn't Dominican York. No, no. They were they were <laughs> they were Hicks. Hicks. They were Hicks. Yeah. But those that, those were the first for real for real for real. That's like the first generation, because that's when niggas came from the you know, 70s you know that when we went to, to New York there wasn't a lot of Dominican families bro. oh hell no there wasn't a lot of Dominican well, families in the so building where I lived there was only two Dominican families we had families. two families too so in 161 so and, and across the street from the building where, where I used to live at 900 there was also a couple of families but yeah. I thought it was Jewish people my Jewish I had my, Italians my, my area was Jewish I lived on 179 and I had Italians uh, and and Puerto Ricans, but these dudes were the first ones that Dominican generation, yeah, the yeah. Dominican generation, because they were Boricua that, that started doing, making noise. They were Boricua oh, that no, were doing no. their thing before yeah, we got yeah, there, yeah, because that was Puerto Rican land. See, I see. Entonces, it. Entonces, pero that's another story. But that's another story. That'll gonna, be another podcast. Another podcast. Heights podcast. Baby boy. my man. Yo, so my we're man. gonna leave it at that. We're gonna come at you once we get this studio set up. We're gonna continue interviewing people, me and Billy Boy, and right. you know, we're gonna bring we're him. gonna bring you a lot of history about the heights from back in the days, and maybe you know we'll get up to 
nowadays and interview a couple of young cats from nowadays. Of course. They're into course. music now, so we yeah. need to give yeah, them their props. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they need to stay like your cousin. Yeah. What's his name? Lex. No, no. The, the one that we talked about on, on when Lex was there. Your your wife's nephew or something. Ah, ah yeah, he's a low key. Low key. Shout out to low key. Shout yeah, out he, to low key. He's good. Okay. He's in he's in he's in, he uh, left already? He's in Connecticut, something uh, like that. Oh shit. Or Pennsylvania somewhere. Whatever. Low key. He's a he's a new, he's a new coming uh artist. trap 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 artist. Trap artist. Yeah. Low key de nosotros. Ya Te queremos. Así que you know um this is another episode for the hype podcast. We're gonna leave it at that and we're gonna come at you with another episode. Pretty soon. Peace. Peace.